Manchester United defender Ari Maguire said he feared for his life when Greek police officers arrested him last week as he thought he was being kidnapped. When asked what happened that night, Maguire said he was on holiday with his fiance Fern, his younger sister Daisy and some other friends. They were out for drinks in Mykonos and texted their minibus driver to come pick them to take them home. The driver was 20 minutes late and Maguire said the group were tired and planning to head back to the villa. So he admitted they got into a scuffle with a bunch of guys. Maguire said everyone was shouting and was screaming. Then three Greek men dressed in plain clothes got involved. Maguire said they were not trying to cause an argument or a scuffle, but it was just a lot of shouting, a lot of commotion. No fighting as it was reported, no punches were thrown. Maguire said as he turned to walk back to the bus, he and his friend had been circled by ununiformed men who started walking towards them. Maguire said, we got on our knees, put our hands in the air, and they started eating us. They got one of my hands in the handcuff, they were eating my legs, saying, my career is over, no more football, I won't play again. At this point, I thought there was no chance these people were police. I had no idea who they were, so I tried to run away. I had one hand in the handcuff, I was moving my hand. This is where the charges have come from, this is what they are trying to say is resisting arrest, and this is what the assault is. No punches were thrown, I didn't believe they were police officers, Maguire said. On Tuesday, Maguire was given a suspended sentence of 21 months and 10 days in prison after his trial on the Greek island of Syros. He was found guilty of repeated bodily harm, attempted bribery, violence against public authorities and insult after arrest. Chelsea Football Club of England have confirmed the signing of virtual centre-back Thiago Silva from Paris Saint-Germain as the Brazilian defender makes the move to Stamford Bridge from Paris. Silva's move to Stamford Bridge comes after his 8-year PSG stay came to an end after the club's loss to Bayern Munich in the Champions League final. The 35 year old who served as the captain in that defeat, they passed the French side with a joint record, 7 Ligue 1 titles, as well as 5 Cup de la Ligue and 5 Cup de France. During his time in PSG, Silva made a total of 315 appearances, including 21 appearances this season, as PSG won a domestic treble. Silva, who makes a move on the free transfer, has not joined Chelsea on a one-year deal, with the option of extending that deal by one for that season. He becomes Chelsea's fifth major signing of the window, with Hakim Ziyech, Timo Werner, Ben Chiwell and Malang Sa already being signed up. His move to PSG in 2012 came with a fee of £42 million, making him the then second most expensive defender in history at the time, behind Manchester United's Rio Ferdinand. Internationally, Silva has been a mainstay for Brazil throughout the last decade, earning 89 total caps while scoring 7 goals for his country. Silva has won silver and bronze at the Olympics with Brazil, while also claiming the 2013 Confederations Cup and the 2019 Copa America crown on home soil.